that I can just you do? take it out of the shelf. Okay. Yeah. And I'll assemble it and decorate it with tempered white chocolate. Okay. All right. Okay. Cool. That was like perfect timing for that. I'm gonna create the coffin out of a sobbly cookie dough. It's a form of cookie that's very hard, so it's gonna be good as long as we carve it out correctly. Okay, if you make it, I'll decorate it. I'm gonna paint out a dough brown so it can look like a truly wood coffin. How you feel about that? I say go wherever the vampire spirit leads you. <laughs> so I'll make it. And give you the pieces you want to glue it together. Yeah. I made a slightly larger batch of shortbread. Oh, nice. Bakers, 45 minutes left. Uh oh. That's very good, girl. Uh oh. Holly's hand pies did not look good. Yeah. Holly, what's up with those hand pies? I think they look delicious. You think they look delicious? Yes. Okay. I mean, it looks like we have a lot of filling outside the pie. <laughs> there was a lot of filling in there. Oh, a lot of filling in the pie. Okay, okay. My pies look like that. They're a little worried, but you're cool. Yeah, it'll be fine. Okay. This Halloween, there's no rest but beats with the bakers because the devil is in the details. All new Halloween Baking Championship. Next, on Food Network and Food Network Go. This week, on the Upper Hands, special guest Flow challenges the hand models to show off the ease of comparing rates with Progressive's home court explorer, international hand model Jean Jean. It's personal. The way with Pinky is grotesque. Then, a high stakes patty cake battle royale ends in triumph. You have the Upper Hand! It's a race to the lowest rate, and so much more. Only on the Upper Hand. <laughs> He loves catching crunchy <laughs> health bars and dancing Dex 